Hey everyone, my name is JPW03 and welcome back to another game recap. The Lightning win this one 7-2 over the Columbus Blue Jackets. Um, I feel like we just took all of the goals we should have scored against the Rangers and just really scored them all tonight. So definitely found our offensive game. Really great to see. So many highlights to go through, so we're going to go ahead and get those started. But if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like on it as it does help out a lot. And make sure to subscribe if you're new, guys. Our new goal is 17,000 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for helping us hit 16,000. And now we're already 200 plus on our way to 17. So thank you so much for that. And again, let me know what you thought about the game down in the comment section below. Let's go ahead and get into some highlights. Kicking us off on the power play. It's going to be Palat right there. A sneaky little kick to himself. You're going to see it more on the other replay, but this is actually quite the move. Uh, Pointer is going to do a little half pass, and he's going to kick it right to himself, and what a goal. Take a look at it right here. Pointer kind of loses it slash passes it, and Palat's like, hey, I got you. No problem. And Palat actually takes a penalty, comes right out of the box, and he's going to get rewarded for that, I guess. He's going to score this redirection right there. Absolutely nothing Corpusala could do on that one. It is a heck of a tip. You got to watch the replay. How about this redirection? I mean, Corpus All is dedicated to saving it and that it just completely changes direction. I mean, it is a harsh redirection right there, as you can see. What a goal by Palat. And now on the power play, once again, Maroon's going to shoot it. That one's going to be saved, and it's going to be Corey Perry cashing it in. Things just went from bad to worse for poor Columbus right there. And so the Lightning headed to the first intermission up by three. Honestly, that first period was really just a fantastic one for the Lightning. Uh, John Cooper mentioned in the media that he wanted the team to play fast, and that's exactly what they did. Obviously, I referred to that in the last recap we had against the Rangers. Uh, they definitely came here with a mission in mind, and they executed it really Really, really well and now we are here in the second period of first minute Kukin is gonna get the Blue Jackets on the board Vassy makes the initial save but just unable to find the rebound and Kukin does and he buries it past Vassy just take one more look at it again because it is actually quite a spectacular initial save from Vassy but he just had no idea where that rebound went and immediately following that the landing right all right you guys are gonna score we'll score right back no problem foot with a great little pass right there two pointer and pointer you didn't quite see it from that other angle I hope you see it on this one great goal right there but look how far pointer just slides on the ice he's just like all right I scored I got nothing to stand up for I'm just gonna slide all the way downtown right here and Columbus once again, catching the lightning on the second period change is going to have Gustav Nyquist in all alone. And what a snipe it is. Top corner. Nothing Vassy could do on that one. Sometimes you got to tip your hat to good goals. I mean, that's just a good goal. Let's take one more look at it right here because Vassy's a big guy. I mean, it's not easy to find the corner and Nyquist does. So I don't normally show a ton of saves, but I did want to show this one because this was honestly the turning point in the game. If they score this one, it's game on. But what a save by Vasilevsky. You have to see it from this other angle to truly appreciate just what Vassy did. Because again, they had the whole net to shoot at. I mean, that might have hit McDonough in the face if Vassy didn't kick it. But either way, what a save. Now the Lightning back on the power play 4-2 right now. And it's going to be Patrick Maroon getting the feed from Corey Perry. And he's going to bury that one to make it 5-2. That is now three power play goals for the Lightning. Uh, certainly the power play was clicking tonight, and you really love to see that as obviously we've had some struggles without Kudrov in our lineup. So the second period ends 5-2, to two, and I mean, honestly, the third period is more of a test for the Lightning. I will say, now this is super nitpicking, and at the end of the day, you know, it's going to be hard to play intense when you're up 5-2. to two. There still was a number of odd man breakaways for the Columbus Blue Jackets in the third period. There is certainly some one-on-one, some two-on-ones. That happens. I'm not too worried about that, but I just wanted to note that because I know somebody would if I didn't. So I just want to say it so that way you know that I, th I thought about it and I witnessed it, but I just wanted you to know that. So first minute, I'm only going to show this angle because this is all you need to see. First minute of the third period, Belly's going to shoot it. And then the final goal would come under eight minutes left and Killer's just going to have some patience right there lift it over corpus Allo. again not too much the game was already over by this point anyways and that is it seven to two is your final score uh this is the type of game you wanted to see especially after the ranger game where the lightning were shooting 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 couldn't beat the goaltender yeah i mean just a really solid game for the lightning but i want to know what you guys think about this one again let me know down in the comment section below if you enjoyed it please leave a like on it i believe we come home to play the flames next and then we go into boston boston's going to be a big test for me personally we did beat the boston bruins last time we played them but we did not play very well so I'd love to see us play well against them this time. The Flames are losing pretty bad tonight against the Panthers.
Panthers, but they're still a really good team, so I'm interested to see how we will play up against them. Again, my name is JPW03, and if you're new, please make sure to subscribe to the channel as it does help out a lot. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, go Bolts!